makes me so proud of it. <laughs> but anyway, um, that movie, uh, every time I watch it, I would visualize today. And I gotta tell you, it turned out better than I ever, ever imagined. Wow. But, uh, well, excuse me. <laughs> the, uh, I'm writing the confession part here. <laughs> but anyway, uh, as we watch the movie, as many times as I watch it, there's about a half a dozen places that I always get emotional. I'm not especially known for showing sure, emotion, but tonight, this yeah. is everybody knows tonight all bets are off. <laughs> you can't blame it on allergies or anything. Like that. Uh, there's been uh, a lot of good planning that's going into making this such a tremendous event. Uh, a lot of people put, in, put a lot of hard work and energy into it. In typical Amy fashion, she got a clear picture in her mind of exactly what she wanted. Terry very quickly agreed. <laughs> <laughs> and then she started to enlist the help of some uh, close friends, some people who care not very much about her to help pull the whole thing off. So again, as I said, a group effort, tremendous effort on everybody's part. But I saw some cr special kudos all go out to Tony and Emily for the energy and the uh, enthusiasm and the, and the support that they gave for putting everything together. Very much. Um, I don't know if you all know the significance of having an event here at the hotel, but we've been coming here as a family for a long time. We've got a lot of great memories here. So it was uh, kind of a natural when it came time to pick the place for the wedding that this would be at the top of the list. Um, I was thinking back on some of the memories. That the first time we came as a family, Andy had just turned one. Nancy and I couldn't wait to take her to Disney World. <laughs> the happiest place on earth, right? Right. Uh, yeah. As it turned out, uh, Mickey, Minnie, and all their friends absolutely scared her to death. <laughs> <laughs> and y'all trust me when I can tell you they were not tears of joy. <laughs> we thought we were being such great parents, right? And that same trip, the hotel brought a beautiful brass crib up to the room for her to sleep in. As it turned out, that didn't work either. <laughs> For whatever reason, only a one-year-old I think could understand, she uh, wanted to sleep in one of the big dresser drawers in, in the room. <laughs> so yeah. I looked at parents, right? We, we sat on the camp in the floor, and then we, we take turns staying up at night, making sure that she's safe, right? And then uh, uh, I lost my tail off the car. We stayed up, and oh, the other thing, we just spent the entire week working down here, uh, hoping that the you know, housekeeper didn't report us. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I remember going down the slide in the pool for the first time, uh, playing on the beach. Uh, she had the first horseback right here, right yep. the stairs, yeah. yep. playing on the pitching putt, where we just, where we just were. Uh, fast forward to today, she outdrives me on every one of the 45 <laughs> 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 All but that last one, I think. But uh, it's all been a joy, there's no question about that. Uh, I gotta say though that all the memories over the years, more today did I ever make a major deposit to the memory bank. <laughs> Seeing her for the first time in a beautiful dress, uh, how happy she is. Um, I, gotta, I gotta think back to the moment for just a minute, because I was kind of zoned out for just a second. But you can imagine the relief that I had when it turned out to actually be a beautiful wedding dress. Yeah. It wasn't a white set new Nike jogging suit. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Say no more. <laughs> I have those more often than I have. But I was going to mention is the Reverend Bob Williams. Uh, he did such a great job for us. I do have to say, I don't mean to embarrass anybody, but never in my wildest imagination, imagination did I think I would use the terms Bob and Debbie. He did such a great job, and I know you hope you know how much to read that means to read Star Wars. He told me earlier that uh, before tonight, he thought officiating was just something that's done very badly all the time. Anyway, he said something to me a long time ago that I've never forgotten. I don't know if, I'll, if, I'll, if he'll ever remember this or not, but I can 